suited here. This had a big hose on it, so everybody's hosing down and ready to go. Next stage you would go through once you've hosed down. Um, I don't know if anybody from your chemistry lessons at school. Wow. Chalk? No. Chalk? No. Buried? No. Mm. It's, not it's going to be something to take away acids or alkalines. It's going to be a killer, is it? To kill off something? Yes, yeah, full of acids. Ah, oh, yeah. Very absorbent, so anything left on you mm-hmm. absorbs straight out into there. I once told the tour that if you manage to get to this point, that was the cocaine as you call it. They actually believed me. <laughs> but no, as full as that, so then you would be decontaminating then through here, and then through various stages, monitored all the way Ooh. through. And what was the capacity? In terms of um, how many people would be. Sorry, whoops. I know there's the timing factor, yeah. but in terms of. No idea, no idea. It's, almost, I know certain bits because we've had American yeah. salesmen here. It was one of the most secure buildings in the country at one time. So, yeah, I'd love to be able to answer. Again, just stages going through. <laughs> Coming into this area, you are actually in the showers. So there used to be shower heads above you there. If you want to come in, can we all squeeze in? Yeah, thank you. So you get to this point, you'll be in the shower, and then your chemical and biological suit. We go back through the laundry hatch, um, get recycled back through in the system, back to the beginning. I squeeze food. Thank you. We do so as this one. The rowing station seven, pick one car dry off. Right. Get some available clothing back into your work area. Not so much now, but a few years ago, we've got an awful lot of Americans coming through. And Americans like to make a pilgrimage back to where they had that Nixon had been shot. So they come back and say, this is where I have Nixon being shot. I don't know why, but yeah. 
Do you mean JFK? Kennedy. JFK. Yeah. Sorry. JFK. I did wish Nixon had been shot. shot yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. Not like in the history, but yeah, JFK, where he had been shot. So, yeah, we've had quite a few people. Oh. Through. This is the main control desk. Um, so, again, that's the outline of the data centre as it is at the moment. Decontamination chambers. Got communication through to all parts and everything else. Um, we can lock down doors, um, open doors, shut doors. It was all controlled from here. How old is this thing? Probably, I would think it was probably about nine, mid 80s. Yeah, going to the relays, diodes, everything else. It took me three days to get it working. Mm -hmm. um, and do you have enough spare parts? <laughs> One of the things we found that if it doesn't work on a relay, hit it and it will just release and go. So it was back to proper old engineering. What I did originally, relays, diodes. Mm. If it does, give it a clue. That's mm. it. So. Right, we've got some this one. Especially when you've got nuclear weapons yeah, yeah. and stuff like that. I thought it was a guy. No, it would have been the door. Just be careful when you go in here, the floor does drop away quite sharply. Oh, it's fashion. Is that good or bad thing? Mmm. Oops, it is. It's a little bit of a bit of a so we have to come on the camera attack. Oh, oh shit. Slidey, sli 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 yeah. We would have uh, this area here. We would have uh, uh, shut down the uh, whole uh, party. Yeah. The whole thing to be launched. And the seals from the outside world apart from uh, the valves going to the gas filters. Gas filters would have been built of white charcoal. So that would have been pumped through. Meanwhile, while that system's up and running, the gas bottles over there, the oxygen would have been fed into the system to bring the pressure up in the building to keep everything leaking out through this fan system. And then once we've got enough air, we feed the filter there in and keep the pressure up. So keep the nasties out. It was that simple. Don't try and seal the building, just put the pressure up and have it leaking out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, makes sense. Logical. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, yeah, this is one of the smaller plant rooms. Cool. Any questions? You have opened this thing. Sorry? You have opened this thing to see this side. Yeah, we have. Um, and it's just a big tank. Um, the tank from here, the contaminated sewage tank, you've got nozzles, I don't know if you noticed when I walked down the path, there was a slope. Mm -hmm. The pipes are in underneath that slope, so that was a blast deflection slope to protect the pipes. Yeah. So the whole building, if you look over the bits that are painted terracotta or blast walls, um, so that they would take the impact um, and present the other side of that door, you've got a wall that thick. Um, again, a blast wall, deflection walls. And was it an exclusive US? base or were there serving British the, personnel here? It was USAF, RAF, Green and Common. Okay, so, so it was controlled by the Americans, but it had MLD police. Mm -hmm. um, and then the perimeter protection during the protests was uh, seven UK soldiers. So British Armed Forces that provided the protection. Uh, but the Americans actually effectively, it was their aircraft, mm. their missiles, everything else. Is it true there was um, a fire on Green and Con? There was one plane came down and put a fuel tank through one of the hangars that dropped one of its tanks. Um, there's a lot of rumours that went about at the time. Um, the hangar's now been demolished, but you could see a section of wall that had been replaced. Um, we don't think the tank actually caught fire. Uh, we think it was empty when it went through the hangar. Mm -hmm. um, the only one that we are sure of was um, just before D-Day, um, Eisenhower and Churchill did the Eyes of the World speech at the far end of the runway. Um, but a week, 10 days prior to that, we had horse of gliders. Newbury historically was a furniture making town. The furniture makers, 
co-pilot, so they named the roads after me every single wow. year, big memorial. Mm -hmm. But nobody knew about it for, for years. Yeah. Cool. I think we're done. Right. So we go back to the one and have some lunch. Yes, that's yeah. good. Sounds good. Well, thank you very much. Thank Thanks. <clears throat> Oh, oh, cheers. Thanks, mate. <laughs> if I do stick it anywhere, by the way, I'll blur everyone's faces out. I was keeping it down low so, that, you know, I don't have to do more work blurring. It just takes forever to let me do it. Yeah, watch this. It's a bit slidey there. It's, it's not good. Yeah. I know some lads uh, from a YouTube site called IKS. Mm -hmm. uh, you were the guy who gave them the tour, was it? Go. No. Okay. Uh, we've had them as a sub botanical bit. Yes, I'm a member of that actually, some Brits. So, yeah. yeah, we get. They try and get in quite a lot.